Hi guys, my name is Fire Fire and welcome back to a brand new episode of Timberborn where we're making a modular base in one district. And what I mean by modular is we are making these square modules that are surrounded by water. Well, most of them are. And they all have their own function. Now in the last episode, we built our little entertainment area. Got a nice little swimming pool. Look at that guy. Loving life right now. Loving life. And we've got the mud baths and the carousels. So on this episode, I want to get this area done. Like we need to, we need to finish off this mountain now. I've had enough of it. <laughs> I've had enough. So the plan is we are going to cap off this um, mountain with levees all the way around. So that, it, well, not maybe not the back, but around the sides here. So it makes it look like it's part of the base that we've designed, part of our same aesthetic. And we're going to increase this area here to maybe flow down here. And once we've done that, we're finally going to start working on this. Now, I've got an idea. I've had a few comments about this. Everyone has amazing ideas on this. But I really like the thought of a sort of monastery on a moat. Now, someone did talk about a moat, and a few people have sort of talk, spoken about monasteries. Now, I've been trying to look at pictures to sort of get some ideas of real life stuff, but none of them really translate into what I want to do. But we're going to do something like, we're going to expen extend this out and we're going to make a central part, maybe around here. And then it's going to be surrounded by water, which is the moat. And then we're going to have um, water drop-offs to fill up the water. Now, in here, we're going to have maybe one or two temples with some houses or something to look like corners of a monastery or something. We, we, we're going to figure it out as we go. But first, we need to start prepping and we need to do some explosions. There's also this one tree right down here that is impossible to get to unless you block all this area and dig it out. But we're not going to do that. So first things first, we need to make the levees all the way around. Okay, so now that is done. We've got this going around. I did put a line up here, just for the sake of it. You know, it's the end of the line. We're mostly going to blow this up in a sec as well. But I want to expand this area. I want to put more observatories and I want to put a few more campfires. Now, how are we going to get up there? <laughs> How are we going to get up there? Um, what is the pathing like? Pathing's not too terrible. You know what? Let's put this here first. And then we can do this for now. Then we can cut down some trees and make a pathway going down from in here. And we should make a pathway from here as well. Or somewhere here. No, actually, we could do something like this. I don't actually need that there, actually. Now, I am going to delete a lot of the trees for now. But we can put them back once needed. So what we can do in here is if we get some campfires, how would that fit? You know what? That's not too bad. Oops, is it saving? Bit of a lag there. Could get some campfires like that and we can get another observatory, I think. So if we do, I think it's nine, three by three. Now I am putting them like sporadically around because I just think it makes it look a bit more natural. I want to get one more in here around here somewhere and some more campfires and then we'll get um some more trees in any way shape or form so let's start deleting the trees here now I also need to delete trees over here because i want to see what the landscape looks like we've got to play around with this we've got a lot to do so we need to see what we're playing with 
So let's get that and let's delete all the trees here. And you know what, let's move it down. And I'm most likely gonna put trees again. I'm most likely gonna put trees again. Also, since it was in the drought, I thought I'd put this around here. Keep with the theme, keep with the theme. So I'm thinking with this, like I was saying before, we're gonna have a central area surrounded by water. Now, we're gonna have the outer bit here. We're gonna have two rows of water, I think, or maybe even more. For now, it's two rows. It may be three. Let's blow this up. And let's get, oh, they're going to that. That's exactly what I wanted them to go to. Because I wanna put that all the way across like that. And then we can make levees coming up here. And that can be like that. Now I could raise the level of this, but I don't think we need to. I don't think we need to raise the level of the wall. I think it's fine exactly where it is. And we need more dynamites. We Lucky I've got like maybe 2,000 dynamites because this is going to be an explosive episode. <laughs> Pun intended. Okay, so they don't have any way of getting down there, which is absolutely fine for now because we're going to make a way. Just like that. Just like that. It's as simple as that sometimes. Sometimes the solution is extremely easy. All right. So let's get another observatory around here somewhere. I want to put it more on the inside. Of course, they didn't delete the trees that I actually wanted them to delete. But that's because I didn't do it properly. All right, let's delete this. Let's put this as a higher priority so they get that done. Because they're going to be doing every other thing before they do that. All right, now that's done. Let's get an observatory around here somewhere. Cool. And then we can get more, um, what are they called? Campfires. Maybe get one here. Oh, no, I don't want it like that. A secret, oh, secret campfire here, but it can't fit. It can fit like that. And then we can have trees. Actually, I'll put this a bit more out here so it's not close. Then we have our secret pathway. Where can I get from? Okay, go from here, like that, like that. Cool, and then I'm gonna get a forester down because we need to be planting some trees. In fact, I, oh, they've already put planks in it. Okay, it's only 48 planks. I'm gonna put the forester here first, plant the trees, and then I'll put the um, observatory back. So that's sort of done. I'm, I'm relatively happy with that. I'm gonna delete that and that. I waste so many resources. <laughs> My way is not efficient at all. I'm going to put that there. And the reason why I'm doing that is because we're going to start blowing up this area and bringing it all the way down to the bottom there. So there's no pillar here to block views. Let's get that and let's do that. All right. So this bit is done. Cool. I like it. Let's get all of that. Let's get that. So now, okay, so what are we looking at? What are we looking at? Let's get this. I need to make it, I need to shave this tree, these, uh, this mountain with all the trees. So I'm gonna delete all these trees. And once that's done, we'll start landscaping. Okay, so our mountain is now naked we can now properly plan on what we're going to do here. 
So this was the previous waterfall. We don't use that anymore. I think I can shave this off. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to delete everything. <laughs> I'm going to just delete it all. We are redoing the whole thing. Oh, that hurts. That hurts so much. Okay. So this is the space we've got to play in. Now let them carry on doing what they're doing. I kind of like this area. It may change, but I kind of like it for now. So I'm going to leave that there for now. If I make the water along here, I could make it go along here as well. So that would give me, let's put, I'm going to put this as a sort of indicator of where my water is going to be. You've got path in there, path in there. It could go out to here. And then, hmm. And I could actually make it come out more. So say we go to this end bit here. That is going to take a lot of levies. <laughs> that is going to take a lot. We need to get down here as well to cut out all these trees. Which I can mostly do from here. Like that. Like that. And like that let's just get them started on that so that means i don't even know if the path is going to be long enough to get all of that what is it like at the moment oh it's red there mm. hmm but as long as we cut the trees maybe we can use this one because it's only orange yeah i think we could use that and maybe if we delete some stuff up here. So I still, I really do like the layered effect. I really do. So if we have, that would be where our levy is. Water, water, water coming up to here. Our levy would be here and our water would be like this, right? So that will come in and go into there. That means we've got, you know what, we've got a decent amount of room. We've got a decent amount of room. And if I delete this stuff and just leave it one block, we've got like a double step coming up, which I'm not too, I, I like it, I like it. I'm not too fussed about that. We'll have to fill this in. Well, this could be part of the water system as well, to be honest with you. We'll see how we go with that. So let's explode everything. And now with all of that blown up, we have this sort of free layer area. Let me put some more dynamites down. So no one's idle, they keep working. Because this bit is gonna be our water area. Now it's gonna be one level. I might make it a bit lower actually. So it looks deeper. Mm. But we can do that once the finished product is there. Now, again, we're gonna go like, should I go like this? You know, I don't mind it. I don't mind it. So this is gonna be our area. Now I can't get down here because it's just too far from the district. It actually stops right there. So what we may do, we may make a quick district here to cut down the trees and then just delete the district and get back to what we were doing. So how are we going to design this? We've got a decent amount of area, to be honest with you. Now I'm wondering, oh, actually, I should actually leave that there. I'm wondering if this might level up too high. 
to make the water look not impactful. We may need to put more water. <laughs> we may do three layers. Let's see what we've got with um in terms of space. So if we get a temple wherever you are. Now I'm not really bothered about efficiency. I, I just want it to look nice. So if we let's pause it, if we put one there and one there, they can't actually get up into there. Which is something that I do want them to be doing. What is it's too much, isn't it? It's like two more. Mm. We could do like one with loads of shrines. And then we could increase the space of the water like that. And we could lower it down a little bit more. Because I've, I've got to be really careful because we are running out of um, land mass. So to do, we would actually put a bridge along here, which is going to be pretty cool. But I really want the water to be, to be a little bit more impactful. So I want quite a bit of water, to be honest with you. Yeah, what we may do, we may bring it one more. So the levees will start here and there'll be three layers of water. We're not going to get everyone in a temple, but you know what? That's fine. That'll go like that and that'll go like that. Okay, that's fine. So now we can work with this. So on that note, I may bring this all down one level. So that we have this big space here and we can have a little bit up here. Yeah, I'm, I'm I'm okay with that. <laughs> I'm definitely okay with that. What are we looking at with this? If I delete this for now, how many temples can I get up here? I can only get one. If I had it there, I could actually get two. They'd just look out of place, wouldn't it? But yeah, I, I think it would look out of place. I don't think it would look that great. Okay, so I've, I've come to a conclusion. <laughs> After a bit of time, I've come to a conclusion. I'm going to bring this down a level. We are going to leave this here. We're going to only leave two on the side here, but we're going to put more water at the front. And what I'm going to do is... We, let's delete this for now because I don't know how many I'm going to need here. Yeah, let's do that. So what I'm going to do is... No. I'm going to put actually two temples side by side. Now, you won't be able to get up here, but you will be able to get up via the sides here. If I bring everything down a level, that shouldn't be too bad. And then we're going we're gonna to make this a little bit wider. So maybe, so it'll be one here, two, three, maybe even four. We're going to put the temples here. And then we're going to make a bit of river here. Yes, I like it. I like it. And that way, it will look like it's surrounded by water. I think we have a plan, guys. I think we have a plan. So we actually need to delete these. Uh, delete that. 
we need to put that there. So that will be three layers of water. We need to get that. Okay. Can they not reach that? Okay, that's fine. So I'm going to get all of this carved out and then we're going to design the actual temple area. And just like that, we are done landscaping this beautiful place. It doesn't look beautiful now because we're in a drought. It looks all brown, it looks miserable. We need to be green and look absolutely beautiful. So what are we going to do? We're just placing them dynamites. Let's work out this area. Let's delete all this for now. We'll get some pathing in there in a sec. Let's do that. And let's do that. Now, I want to plan this out before I fill this in with levees because this is going to take a ton of wood. Literally, it's going to take so much wood. <laughs> so I want to get the middle bit done first. All right. All right. Are we getting frame rate issues? Is it saving? Let's turn it down to speed. Okay, that's a little bit better. While we plan this out, let's just turn that down. Let's uh, blow that up. And blow this up. Wait, do I need to go down one more? I think I... Do you do that? Yeah, I do. Yeah. There we go. All right. All right, so... We're going to have, so this bit is going to be water, right? Let's get our temples. Now, I don't know what I'm going to use this back bit for, so I might just put the temples back here. Let's actually pause it so they don't start building it. And then we're going to have bridges going over the water. So where would I like the bridges? Maybe like this? But I won't be able to pull it on the opposite side because there won't be enough space. So maybe we just do the longer bridges. Like that. That gives us room to go over. Let me just make sure I'm doing this right. In fact, we could actually do the smaller bridges. It just means it won't be in line with this. Because we will have to do it on this. Let's delete that. We can do that. And that like that. Now, I do need to change this levee into a platform. So let's get... In fact, we need to blow that up, don't we? But we don't need to. Because no one's going to see that. Actually, they may see it when I delete everything. Okay, so let's quickly just put these on high priority. Let's blow these two up. I didn't put on high priority, did I? There we go. All right, so they've been planted. Let's actually, you can't designate why you pulls it. There you go. Now, let's continue. Let's continue this planning. All right, so we're going to put it like that. We're going to put it like that. Going to get that across. That across and that across. That kind of makes me want to put just one of these temples like in the middle like that. And then maybe we can put another one up here somewhere. It's going to look out of sync though, isn't it? Let's, let's just see how this goes. You can do something like this. Let's 
we can put some shrines in here. Like that. And then we can get some trees in here. What tree should we use? Maple? And some bushes or some benches. Let's put a bush. And then we can get you're facing the right way. Lovely. Maybe some fence in here. And then we'll do this. And we'll pretty much do the same sort of thing here. There we go. Okay, okay, it's not looking too bad. Can I actually get a um, campfire in this area here? Oh. Hmm. But that just leaves this space so empty. We'll just leave that like that, actually. And then we'll make a little garden area here. So how are we going to make a garden area? I want to plan it out first. So I want, we need quite a bit of space. In fact, that can go a bit closer, I believe. Yeah, I think I can go closer. Then we get some benches. Like so. We'll get some more of this. We'll get some trees in here as well. Can't forget the trees. Now we've got maple down there. Should we get some chestnut trees in here? Mm, how does that look? We'll have that, we'll have that. I could put two more trees actually. Put it like that. And then, with pathways, we can go in here, like so. We can actually have um, some roof in there, roofing. As you're coming into the garden. Because you don't want the sun to, um, you don't want the sun to burn your skin. If it does. Although we can't put roofing over the benches. But that's okay. And then maybe we can get two more trees. Two more chestnut trees. And actually, let's put some berries here. And then a bit of fencing. Along here, just to sort of... Um, lock it off to show that it's sort of like a different area okay i'm working with that we can actually take that tree away actually and that could lead up into here as well as well as the pathway on the side in fact we wouldn't even need the pathway on the side okay yeah let's do that. Let's do that. We can always change it. I, but I do want to stop changing this. I've, I think that I've changed this so many times. Um, we could do something like that. And then we'll move over to here. In which we can have a another sort of shrine area. But this time... It's like they're going to be worshipping a tree, I would say. So if we can get a tree, where would we put it? What tree would we have? 
not birch. We've got chestnut, we've got maple. Pine tree right in the middle there. And then let's just see how it looks. It, it, I might not do this. Then we can put a shrine. Here, 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 and here. We can put some uh, bushes. Then we'll need passing. Which I'm not too ecstatic about this kind of passing. So we may just not put that there because then we can do this. We can put a chestnut tree back there. And we can put some fence in. We don't want them to fall and hurt themselves, do we? Put some fence in like that. That's okay with me. I am happy with that. And then should they be able to come round here? What do you think? Maybe... Maybe for now we can put... Um, we can put another campfire, actually. But we can also put the water drop-offs there. Now, I may use mechanical water pumps in this area because this is a lot to fill up and I don't know if uh, water dumps can actually keep up with that. That can actually go. So for now, we're going to fill this bit in in a bit, but for now, we're going to put a forest there because that's got to hit every single part. If I delete this, oh, I just won't be able to hit the top bit. Okay, we'll put one there, we'll put one there, we'll plant everything. And then we'll change it about. So we're going to let that start doing its job. And um, I'll see you guys in a bit. And there you have it. It's finally complete. Look at that. That looks that looks absolutely beautiful. I'm so glad it's changed. I'm so glad it's changed. Now we've expanded our observatory. We've made sort of like a monastery on a moat. It could have been a bit, a bit better, but you know what? I'm happy with it. I'm totally happy with it. Now, I've put uh, these bad boys, the water drops, or water dumps for now, but there may be a case in the future where we add water pumps here. Also, this is not getting done because there is just not enough pathing. So when I do have pathing on there, it comes up to about here and then it stops at about here. So maybe if I build down here, maybe if I do this, let's just quickly see if that will work. Um, let's see if that helps and lets them get to the last bit so they can do that last bit, which it shouldn't let out water. It looks like it is, but it shouldn't. But I will build it just in case it does. And then water dumps. I don't know if that's enough. It looks like it's enough. It's hitting the top. Yeah, I like it. I like it. That's hitting a very decent amount of water there. All right, so guys, I think that is all I've got time for today. I hoped you enjoyed the episode. I definitely did. I hope you have an amazing day. And I'll see you on the next episode where we're going to be building our life pod module because we can't just have this here. We need to build a proper module. So guys, I'll see you on the next one. Peace.